GVS Speedflow IV filter ensures total safety against air embolism thanks to its four air vents, which guarantees safer and faster air elimination during priming. Let's see the following priming procedure. How to do safe and fast priming with GVS Speedflow. IV set preparation. Bottle or bag on the table. Set the roller clamp in closed position. Check the vent is open position when using glass bottles or rigid containers. No vent or vent closed when using collapsible bags. Check that the male lure lock is equipped with its cap. Spike tip protector. Insert spike into the bottle cap. Close the vent. Hang the bottle with the set connector to the hanger. Height of vent is about 160 to 180 centimeters from the floor level. Squeeze the drip chamber. Fill the drip chamber one half full. Open the vent. You can follow similar procedure when using a bag. Take out the male lure lock cap. Keep the speed flow filter in vertical position with the directional arrow upward. Open the roller clamp. Fill up entire IV line. Speed flow priming. When liquid enters the speed flow, you will see the level of liquid rising and air bubbles coming out through the vents. For fastest priming procedure, keep speed flow in vertical position with the flow arrow pointed up, i.e. invert to prime. The filter will eliminate air faster that way. After priming is completed, speed flow will eliminate air in any position. Checking bubbles. Ensure no air bubbles are trapped into IV line. Close the roller clamp. Connect patient. Connect the IV line through its male lure lock to the patient vascular access. GVS Speed Flow is the perfect patient's protection barrier against particulate, bacteria, air bubbles. This is Speed Flow Priming Explained. Now you are ready to go.